everybody. Welcome in. We are going to be packing up some orders, and I just sold something else. Looks like I'll be packing that up after the live. Wait a couple seconds for TikTok to load in. Appreciate you guys all over on YouTube. If you're re-watching this, make sure you like the stream. All that good stuff. What's good? What's good? What's up, Humphrey? Um, I don't know how many orders. I always forget to count how many orders I have to pack up. Hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 orders to pack up total. 12 total orders to pack up. You pick up cinch button-ups? No, I pick up cinch jeans, though. Button-ups take a little bit longer to, to sell than the... Uh, than the um, the jeans and they don't sell for as much the dark side of vulture culture why is this so it feels like it's so i guess it's because the sunlight's beaming off my shirt it's kind of funky good morning everybody welcome in uh we have 12 orders to pack up um how do you know sell through rate on ebay all you have to do is look up how many is listed versus how many is sold that's your sell through rate so if there's 100 listed and 100 sold that's 100 percent sell through rate i um, just finished packing my four orders going out let's go that's awesome four orders is nothing to sneeze at how many active listings do you have? I have a little over 19, 1,970. I think it's like right around there. Um, last I checked. I'll check here in a minute. Appreciate you guys hopping in. I am on both TikTok and over on YouTube. So if you miss any part of this TikTok, make sure you go watch the uh, stream over on YouTube afterwards. It gets posted to my YouTube feed after I'm done. Um, 12 orders packed up. So let's go ahead and get started. I have, I think, six eBay, um, two Poshmark, two Mercari, and uh, two viewer sales to pack up from last night. So let's get into it. We'll start with the Mercari orders first. This actually just sold right before the live. This is a women's Izod Lacoste sweater. This is a vintage sweater. Um, I picked this up recently. I paid um, $6 for this, so I must have bought it at Salvation Army. And it sold for $31 after fee shipping cost of goods. I make $13.72. How's the death pile though? We're working on it. So that's, that's where it is. Do you promote listings? How much do you? I promote everything at 3%. <clears throat> I have an automatic promotion setup. So as soon as I list something, it automatically gets promoted at 3%. What are you selling? So I sell mostly men's clothing. I sell a little bit of women's clothing too. Um, I sell a little bit of everything, but I focus mainly, mainly on men's clothing. If you watch this whole stream, you're going to see the stuff that I'm, I'm selling. You're going to see a whole pile. We've got Christmas items going out. we got a pair of shoes going out. we got women's items and men's items all going out today. That all sold yesterday. All right. I didn't stream yesterday. I didn't do the, uh, the uh, morning packing live yesterday just because we had to get up and get to the, the thrift store. So I want to be, a I want to get out ASAP. So we didn't do any live stream yesterday, but we're doing it today. Where'd you get that sweater? That one? Um, I got it online. I bought it from another person. Hang on, I need to get a bucket. <clears throat> I think I bought that one on Poshmark, if I can remember correctly. How do you automatically promotion at 3%? I've been paying up to 11%. Um, so you go into your settings, you go into your promotions, and there should be a promoted listings tab. You should be able to start a campaign, and you should be able to promote everything at whatever percent you want. You can promote it for your whole store automatically. Let me get my wife's um, sticker off here. Um, how do I remove it? Do, 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 do. I wonder if I just drag it. So I just drag, there you go. That's how I do it. Who enters all the info in your spreadsheet? I do. I entered it right before I went live. It took me like 10 minutes to enter my stuff into my spreadsheet. For 12 orders, it takes about 10 minutes. It really doesn't take too long. All right, next up, we got a pair of Spanx. Uh, this is a pair of the Velvet Spanx my wife picked up at Red, White, and Blue just last week. Uh, we paid $13.91. We did pay up for them because, obviously, they're brand new with tags. Appreciate the follow, user. If you're not following, hit that follow button top left-hand corner. Um, but these sold for $43 in a week. Spanx leggings go for really good money. This is one of the lower-end ones. Um, there has been some that she's picked up that has sold for around $100. So this is one of the lower-end ones. But we still picked it up for that price. Um, and after fee shipping cost of goods, we make $18.61 in a week. That's not too bad. Um, please give me the name of your spreadsheet so I can download the app. So my spreadsheet is linked in my bio. I have a link tree link in my bio over on um, YouTube. I'll put it in my description after the end of this video. It is Jason Hayes spreadsheet. You use uh, code THANKSWAYNE10, you get 10% off. It's a $40 spreadsheet for the premium version. So you get it for 36, you get it for all year. But as you can see, it's really awesome. I have all my information put in. Um, it tracks your sales, it tracks the best store for you um, that you purchase your stuff from, it, it tracks the best category. So use code THANKSWAYNE10, you get 10% off. It is in my bio. It is a Google Sheets spreadsheet, so you can take it on the go. You just download the Google Sheets app and you can use it on the go. It's an awesome spreadsheet. So use code THANKSWAYNE10, you get 10% off. 
Um, it is linked in my bio. It's the very first link. I just bought the spreadsheet yesterday. Awesome. Yeah, the spreadsheets, you, you're going to love it. The spreadsheet is amazing. I do have a free one on my YouTube channel, but trust me, this spreadsheet is way better than the one that's for free. That's why it's for free. <laughs> that's exactly why it's free. All right, next up, another Kayla sale. She's been she's been doing really good. This is a Victoria's Secret bra. I tried it on myself. It didn't fit, so we ended up selling. I'm just kidding. Uh, we ended up selling the Victoria's Secret bra. It's got, like, the Victoria's Secret, like, um, strap. At a flat rate. It sold on Poshmark for $17. We paid $5.34 for it. So after fee shipping, cost of goods, we make $8. And it sold within, like, a week. Just brought the spreadsheet using code. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. The spreadsheet is only good year. Next year, we have to buy another one. So every year, I believe he updates his spreadsheet, add more to it. So I think for next year, if you really wanted to, you could just delete everything and put everything back in. Um, but he's going to make a new one and it's got better functions. So every year, I'm going to buy a new one. Plus, you're, you're supporting somebody else in the community. So it's awesome uh, to be able to do that. I'm, la I'm lagging already. Come on. Come on. Come on, Wi-Fi. Please, Wi-Fi, don't do this to me. I'm not lagging on uh, on YouTube, though. YouTube's still here. Appreciate you guys hanging out on YouTube. You're not lagging. Wi-Fi, why do this to me? <laughs> oh, why does it do it on my better phone? Okay, here we go. We're back on. We're back. Uh, I can't help the Wi-Fi. They're supposed to be coming out and fixing it uh, this sometime this week. So I apologize for the lag. I, I apologize. Pr trust me. I know. It's annoying. It's very annoying. <laughs> I'm not lagging on YouTube, though. So if you guys want to go watch on YouTube right now, I am not lagging on YouTube. YouTube is good. So I don't know what it is. It's like one of my phones gets hits with a lag spike, and it's simply the connection issue. So we're back, though. We're back. Appreciate you guys hanging out. Why do you mess with me? Okay. Next one, we're going to hold off until the end because it is a bigger box. I don't want to ship this one out just yet. So I'm going to throw this one over with it. All right, now we're going to ship out some of the viewer sales from yesterday. Viewer sales from yesterday. Yeah, we're back. We're good. We're good. Um, viewer sales from yesterday. So yesterday, Ginger, she reached 1,000 uh, followers, by the way. She wanted this um, L.L. Bean sweater. So I sold it to her for a really great price. Um, 30 bucks. I paid six forty two for yesterday after fee shipping cost of goods. I make $12.98. I probably could have sold this for 35 to 40 But like I said, if you guys see anything you like, make sure to hit me up. I'll give you a way better deal on it. Listen, four things and shipped 18. I'm done for the day. Very take the rest of the day off, buddy. You deserve it. Go, go set up a live stream um, where you're throwing little ping pong balls into cups again. And you deserve to do that for the rest of the day. Um, do you use silica jack? No, I don't use that. No, no, I don't. I don't. I do not. All right, so this is just going to go into a regional A box. If you guys know, you know, you can use these box for regular priority now because they discontinued regional boxes. Unfortunately, it looks like they're completely sold out, so you can't get any more of these through the post office, but they're awesome boxes for shipping out uh, sweaters. So that's the that's the reason I use them. You're my FIFO, Feroz, yeah. It should be fine now. We should be back. It's going to do that every once in a while. There's an issue in my area, and they know about it. It's an outage issue where every few minutes the Wi-Fi drops, and then it picks back up. So on some of my devices, it'll drop, and the other devices, for some reason, it stays. Like YouTube didn't lag at all, so I don't, I don't get why it's doing it. Ice covering everything in Michigan. It's nice and sunny here. It's like 80. Um, L.L. Bean uh, fleece pullover tops. You sell L.L. Bean. Yes, L.L. Bean sells very well. This one had an L.L. Bean logo on it, and that's what made it sell really well. Do you pay to promote listings? Everything's promoted at 3%. Um, what would you use if you don't um, use, I don't have a regional box. I would just use a regular box. Like I have Amazon boxes left over, but since I got those regional boxes for free, I just use those. I asked my post office and they said they didn't have any. Yeah, they're probably sold out. Everybody, when it happened, people ordered a bunch of them. So I ordered a hundred of them and I ordered another hundred and I only got from the second order. So that's normal. All right, next sale. Mary, I don't know if she's in the chat right on TikTok. So we're going to wait a second for TikTok to load back up. I have no clue why TikTok is lagging and not. Okay, there we go. We're back. Give it a second. Do, 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 do. All right, we should be back. Let me know. Give me a thumbs up in the chat. We should be back. For some reason, YouTube is not lagging. YouTube's not lagging. So if you guys want to watch me on YouTube, go to YouTube. Um, it's it's not lagging at all for some reason there, but it's, I'm lagging on uh, 
I'm lagging on TikTok. So go watch me on YouTube. You can see the whole thing without any lag. It's amazing over there. All right, next up, Mary bought this North Face hoodie off me. We picked this up yesterday. Um, what did we pay for this? We paid $16.05 for this. It was brand new with tags. I sold it for her to, for $35. So after fee shipping cost goods, we only made $9.60. But again, I'd rather give you guys a great deal. I probably could have listed this for $45, but I sold it for, for, for $35. Made a quick $10 profit. She's happy. I'm happy. We're all happy. She's an awesome person, so... By the way, if you're watching over on YouTube right now, if you could just hit that like button for me, I'd really appreciate it. Appreciate the roses. Thank you so much. Sorry again for the lag. We're trying to fix it. We're doing our best. Last night actually lagged, didn't lag at all. So I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. What's going on? But they're supposed to be coming. It's coming here pretty soon to fix it. The technician came out yesterday, but he said there was nothing he could do. So, by the way, my wife is going to be going live around 11.30 today, too. She's going to be um, packing up, or not going over the things that she picked up yesterday. So, you sell on eBay, where can I find your items? My eBay store is linked in my bio. Um, I sell on eBay, Poshmark, Mercari, and Facebook Marketplace. So, if you want to purchase from eBay, it's probably the easiest way to find my items. Um, eBay is linked in my bio. Comcast, no, I have um, Spectrum. And uh, they, they said that they seen... The technician came out yesterday, he checked all my lines, and he said my lines are good, but the box outside is probably bad. So they got to replace the entire box outside. Um, that's that's what he's assuming, but he can't do that as a technician. So he, they have to send out the big, the big guns. Oh man, I messed this up. There we go. So they're going to come out sometime within the next week. What's the discount code again for my... Um, for the spreadsheet is thanks Wayne 10. If you're talking about list perfectly, it's just K way shop, but I have it on the link. If you go to my link in my link tree, it's like written right there. So what'd you consider um, worthy profit of an item 15, 20. I'm, I'm normally looking for $20 when I'm selling items. But for example, if I pick up an item at a thrift store and a viewer wants it, I'll take $10 profit because I don't have to list it. I just have to ship it. I don't have to make a listing. I don't have to take photos. I'm literally just throwing it in a poly bag and shipping it out. So on this, like $10, some people might be like, why would you pay $15 to make only $10? Because I didn't really have to do anything. I literally just threw this in a bag and shipped it out. So I'll take $10 all day for that. All right, I've already printed out my label for this one as well. Can you remind me uh, what program you use list on all places? I use List Perfectly. I have a link in my bio, use code um, Kway Shop. You get 30% off your first month. I also have a video here on TikTok and on YouTube going over exactly how I, list, I use List Perfectly. I also did it in one of my recent YouTube videos. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't do it on my... I'm going to do it in one of my um, upcoming YouTube videos showing how List Perfectly works. So be on the lookout for that YouTube. Do you prefer uh, boxes to poly mailers? I use poly mailers for lighter weight items and clothing items because it's cheaper to do it that way. With um, that jacket, it was a little bit bigger than a poly mailer could hold, so that's when I would use a box. All right. Wifey's here. She just got done eating her lunch. How was lunch? I made a tiki. Oh, you made a tiki top? I made a tiki. I'm, I'm lagging a little bit, so we'll have to see if your phone lags um, later. Oh, no. Um, how much does this perfectly cost monthly? There's different plans. Um, they give you different things with each plan. Um, I have the most expensive one, which is $69.99 a month. There's a $29.99, a $59.99, and a $69, or no, $29.99, $49.99, and a $69.99 plan. Each plan comes with different things. All right, let's get into shipping these. I just sold something. Actually, I sold two more things, so I'll have to pack those up after live. 14 total sales. Not bad. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Damn it. That's bearded. That's bearded thing. Um, hope that uh, TikTok included lunch. They want to know if your TikTok included your lunch. Did you film your lunch? Um, I can... Nope. Slack. <laughs> All right, next up, we have an Eve St. Laurent shirt. I pick up these shirts as long as they're cheap. I paid $5.34 for this... Or no, I paid six forty one dollars for this shirt. It, sold, it took about two months to sell. It sold for $34.99. Awesome sale on this one. This is just going to go into an eBay poly mailer. I get these free with my quarterly coupon. If you want poly mailers, I suggest to buy them on Amazon. I have a link in my bio to buy that. I know Beard is gonna copyright me for that one. Not bad. Hey guys, I just sold this pony. I picked it up from an auction for $1. I sold it for $5. After fee, shipping, cost of goods, I made $3, but that's okay. It only took me three minutes to list it. Not bad. Is that what he does? I think, I think I'm pretty accurate on him. Come on. Hold on, I gotta reset my scale. There it goes. 
All right, this is going to ship out for eight ounces. Let me raise this desk a little bit. There we go. It's a little easier to easier to use. Um, it's going to ship out for eight ounces, so I'm just going to throw eight ounces into eBay. This is going to New Mexico. It's going to ship for four dollars and thirty-one cents. Let me pull you guys a little closer to me. Beard always says uh, selling something for five and saying not bad. I know it's crazy. He always says that. I'm actually going to make a TikTok about that. I'm going to do it because he made fun of me like a, a week ago. So I got to get him back. I'm going to get him good though. I'm going to get him really good. We picked up this item from an auction for $5. We sold it for $5 and we made absolutely not, no money. But that's okay because it took us no time to pack it up. Uh, thank you. I was at Salvation Army yesterday um, and I got three tactical shorts and pants. Nice. Let's go. Appreciate everybody on YouTube right now hanging out. Uh, if you guys could... Just hit that like button. I'd appreciate it. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the chat. I don't know if we have anybody. Oh, we do. Amy's been in the chat. Daniel's been in the chat. Uh, Riri's been in the chat. Sorry I missed all you guys because uh, for some reason, YouTube doesn't keep my chat up. It just puts it away, but that's okay. I'll, I'll, I'll have to remember to keep going back. I'm still learning the live stream on YouTube. All right, next up, we got a Carhartt shirt. This is not a great pickup. Uh, we paid $8 for this shirt and it only sold for 20 bucks. This is why I don't pick up short sleeve Carhartt shirts. They just don't move anymore. If you do pick them up, pick them up from the bins for a dollar, but don't pay any more than that because they don't move very well. Sold for 20 bucks. I'm gonna make a little bit of money, but not too much. What's up, M. Pierce? <clears throat> you can include, um, you can't wait. You can in, make it curse and say, uh, costs nothing because your baby shipped it themselves. <laughs> oh man, Bearded's a, Bearded's a funny guy. I'm, I'm gonna get him good though. I'm going to get them good. That was fancy. I need a desk like that. Yeah, I picked this one up off Facebook Marketplace. If you guys need a desk, I would just watch Facebook for a good desk. That's what I did. Um, and we got these pretty cheap. I paid $400 a piece, and I got two of the exact same desks. So one for my wife and one for me. And uh, they're amazing. I love them. I love them a lot. I love them a lot. All right, let's pull this back just a little bit. <clears throat> All right, this is going to go into an eBay Polymailer. It's going to ship for eight ounces. Luckily, it's a little cheaper shipping rate and it's going to ship to Arizona for four dollars and 31 cents I keep finding the brand king size do they sell no I don't pick up king size English laundry no I don't pick up English laundry either is your wife live she's gonna be live at 11 30 so right after I'm done here she's gonna be live showing off the items that she picked up from red white and blue yesterday so everybody go give her a follow if you're not following her already over at k the book nerd k the book nerd k-a-y the book nerd yeah, I made $7.69. Yeah, probably after fees and everything. It wasn't that much. That's an item I'm not picking up anymore. So uh, tell me more about your free eBay supplies. Never seen. So the quarterly coupon comes if you have a store subscription. Depending on your level of store subscription, they send you out a quarterly coupon. So right now I have the third level, I believe. So I get $50 every quarter to use on eBay shipping supplies. If you get the next tier up, I think you get 100 The next tier up after that, you get 200 so on and so forth. So um, if you have a store, make sure you look for your quarterly coupon. You'll be able to get a, uh, um, discount. You get basically free shipping supplies. They're not the greatest shipping supplies. Chris at peak knows this. He's in the chat right now. Um, so what I normally would do is if you don't get the quarterly coupon, I would buy stuff like this from Amazon, which is a lot better quality. Um, I have these linked in my link tree, which is in my bio. If you're interested. Okay. The book nerd. Will your wife be live on YouTube? She's not going to be live on YouTube. Unfortunately, she's just going to be live over on TikTok. So um, you got to hop over my TikTok. I'm, I'm sorry if you don't have TikTok. Um, we might bring her on maybe next week. I'll, I'll talk to her about it. What's the benefit of an eBay store minus the coupon? You get a bunch of benefits. If you want to know the exact benefits you get, go just type in eBay, um, eBay store subscription and then hit enter in Google and they're going to have a breakdown of each and every tier of the eBay store. I don't know them off the top of my head. The easiest way is just to Google it. Uh, Jordan three, uh, shock drop right now. There's a Jordan three shock drop. I don't like Jordan three. So if you guys want a Jordan three, go on the sneakers app right now. They're shock dropping, uh, um, Jordan threes. All right. Next up seven for all mankind men's jeans. I pick these up. I tell you guys to pick them up all the time. We paid seven forty seven for these seven for all mankind, uh, mankind jeans. They were size 31. They sold for $38 and 24 cents. So really good profit on these one. This this is going to be closer to that 20, maybe like $23 profit. Um, profit. How often uh, do you get that e eBay quarterly coupon? You get it every, uh, the Jordan 3 white cement just dropped. Jordan 3 white cement. Um, you get the quarterly coupon every quarter. So like uh, January, uh, January, April, 
July, right? It's every three months. Every quarter. Every three months. Price on Kuji, if you want that one, it's 350. And that one, I, I, it's gonna be 350. I'm not even moving on that price. That's my favorite Kuji right there. <laughs> this one has so much detail in it, I just, I have to keep it. <clears throat> um, you pick up J. Crew or Banana Republic. Certain J. Crew pieces I do. J. Crew, um, like the military jackets I'll pick up, but that's pretty much it. I don't pick up, um, I don't pick up hardly anything else J. Crew. The bigger, heavier jackets I normally pick up. Let's see if I missed anybody. YouTube, YouTube is a learning curve. Yeah, it definitely is. Definitely is a learning curve. All right, that one is shipped out. Um, let's go ahead and ship out this one. I had two items that I listed yesterday that sold yesterday. It was really fast sales. This one is one of them. This is a North Face jacket. We did pay up for this one, $13.38. It sold for $35, but I knew it was going to sell super fast. Just a North Face quilted jacket. It's a women's size XL. Sold super fast on eBay. Didn't even get a chance to cross list it before it sold. So really awesome sale. I'm just going to throw this one into a poly bag. I don't think it's going to fit into a padded. So I'm just going to throw a poly bag and ship it out this way. Um, remember, I do have these poly bags linked in my link tree. They are in my bio if you're interested in purchasing direct link from Amazon. If you have a Prime membership, you get free shipping and all that stuff um, with, my, with my link as well. And those links are affiliate links, so they do support the channel. So if you do purchase anything, I do get a little bit of a kickback, but it doesn't cost you any more to click those links. It's just a way for Amazon to say, hey, Wayne, thanks for sending so-and-so over here. Here's an extra 10 cents. That's normally what it ends up being, it's about 10 cents. But I appreciate each of the 10 cents we get. All right, so I sealed this one up. I'm gonna throw a piece of eBay tape on there too. Appreciate the gifts coming in. Sorry if I missed any. I'm in, the, I'm in my zone right now. And sorry for if I missed any questions. At the end of live, I will take questions for a little bit. Um, as I'm shipping, it's a little bit harder to answer all the questions. Obviously, I'm trying to get work done as well, so. Um, bear with me, and at the end of live, we'll go over everything. Um, this is going to be a one pound, one ounce package. It is going to California, so of course it's going to be pretty expensive to ship. It's going for $13 and, $13 and, hang on, we're going to get a better rate than this. <clears throat> we're going to get a better rate than this. We're going to copy this person's name, and we're going to go over to Pirate Ship. We're going to see if I can get a better rate because $13 is a little bit too expensive for this. I bet you if I use Pirate Ship, I could get it down. So we're just going to come over to Pirate Ship. I'm just going to paste their label into Pirate Ship or paste their address into Pirate Ship. And then I'm going to click an envelope. This is a 9 by 11 and it's going to weigh 1 pound, 1 ounce. Now let's see what kind of rates we get off Pirate Ship because 13 bucks is too expensive. Rock Revival jeans, I love picking up Rock Revival jeans. One of my favorite. Where do you get the plastic bags? Linktree link in my bio. That's where I get the pi uh, That's where I get the bags. Linktree link in my bio. Okay, so we saved a little bit. We went from thirteen dollars to ten dollars and eighty-five cents because we went through Pirate Ship. So I'm definitely going to use Pirate Ship. Uh, Priority Mail Cubic ten eighty-five. Way better. So what we do is because we use Pirate Ship to get our label, we have to. I don't have my eBay hooked up to my Pirate Ship, so it doesn't automatically import the label. So all you have to do is just copy your label information and then hop over to eBay, and then paste your label information in. So it says add tracking right below your item. You click add tracking, you paste your tracking number in. Let me just verify it's the same tracking number, it is. And then it's gonna be UPS, and then you're just gonna hit save and continue. And then you're gonna print out your label and you're good to go. There you go. So we made, definitely saved ourselves three bucks. Three bucks in my pocket because I just went over to Pirate Ship and shipped this out. I knew it was gonna be cheaper because I used the bag method. Pirate Ship gets a really good deal on the bag method because on Pirate Ship, they only use the length and the width, all right? The length and the width, they don't use as a height. So they save themselves a little bit and that's normally how they get the, the better better discount. Uh, Wayne has to be uh, do some handstands or just get the junk out. What happened? I have to do handstands? Why do I have to do handstands? All right, that one's shipped. Easy peasy. All right, let's get back out of Pirate Ship. I gotta throw this into my spreadsheet really quick so I don't forget. Uh, North Face Full Zip 1085 is what I paid for it. All right, threw that in my spreadsheet so I don't forget. All right, next sale. This is another item that sold super fast. 
Um, we listed this yesterday and it sold yesterday. Do you pick up, uh, do you pick, do you pick up Hugo Boss suits? I don't do suits, but if you want to know a guy that does suits, Chris at Peak is in the chat. He's actually right up here, um, right up here, the blue logo that you see up here. Click on his name and follow him from there. Uh, for your lawn allergies. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? All right, next up, Untuck It shirt. We literally, I literally just listed this last night and it sold for 30 bucks already. Um, I paid six forty two for this, um, and yeah, it sold for thirty bucks. So sold in a day. Untuck it, one of my favorite brands to pick up. This one is a solid black um, shirt. Solid black shirts tend to sell a little bit better. Solid black, solid white do pretty good. So they sell pretty quick. Peak does. Peak definitely does. Peak does pick up those suits. I'm not a suit guy myself. Mm, what? What are you saying? Chris wants to know if you want to, uh, if you need another nap and want to cuddle. Chris, absolutely. Just hit me up, you know. You can you can text me, Chris. All right, this is going to ship for eight ounces. Eight ounces, eight ounces. Right. I actually don't need a nap. I slept until 10 today, so I, I woke up an hour and a half ago. I'm good. What's your wife's TikTok name? K the book nerd. Can somebody pin okay. her to the top? Or She's going to she's gonna say something in the chat right now. Can somebody pin her name to the top? Go follow her. She's going to be live right after this. She just left a little high. Go follow her. She's going to be going over the haul that we had yesterday, the women's items. I didn't go over them last night. She's going to go over them. Follow her. She's right at the top. Right at the top. If you're over on YouTube, you got to go over to uh, TikTok. She's not going to be on YouTube today, unfortunately. Um, this is going to ship for $4.20. Really awesome. Really cheap. Appreciate everybody on YouTube, too. If you haven't hit that like button, hit the like button. It's free. It takes you two seconds right now. Do one, just do me a favor. Just go down and hit the like, and then you can keep watching. I'd appreciate it. And if you're over on TikTok, just tap the screen. All right, we got one more order. Technically, I have I have three orders, but two of them I didn't pull because they sold during the live. So, um, yeah, <clears throat> I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do those on live, but I'll do them on my wife's live. I'll do them in the background. You guys can see me pack up the other two orders. So, YouTube, what's going on? We got 17 people. We got 10 likes. What's going on over there? What's up? All right, next, last sale is a crappy sale. Really, really, really crappy sale. There we go. We got another like on YouTube. Really crappy sale. Um, you guys know, if, if you know, you know, I picked up a bunch of these. I did them as a hold. The hold didn't work out very good. Um, these are a pair of Jordan one bread toe lows. Um, I actually pick, picked them up from eBay to resell back online, but unfortunately Nike released these like six times. Normally they, they don't do that with Jordan ones. These were supposed to be one of the hottest, like these were supposed to double in price within a few months. And instead of doubling, they like doubled back in price. It, it was really bad. Um, so I'm not making any money on these. I'm actually losing a ton, but at least I'm getting my money back. Um, I think I paid just under, just over 200 for this pair. Um, it's a size 11 and a half, which is a pretty rare size. And these only sold for 160. So I lost like 40 bucks, but Hey, Riri, thank you for the like. Appreciate you. All right, let's grab, um, actually this is my last order. I got one more order after this. I got a, uh, I got a Christmas house that I got to pack up. Do you mind, uh, hold on. I don't actually, I don't need you. I was going to say, do you mind building the box, but I need the tape for this one. So that won't really work out. All right, so this is going to, just going to take a eBay box. I get these free with my quarterly coupon. I'm just going to build the box really quick. Just like that. We're going to throw our shoes inside of the box. These are going to be re-authenticated by eBay. I know they're authentic, obviously, because I bought them from eBay. They've already been authenticated once. So I listen to Pure Hustle Podcast this morning. I love Pure Hustle Podcast. Those guys are awesome. Um, I got to listen to their new podcast uh, today at some point. Um, Xmas houses turn a, a flip tips live. Yeah, I actually sell tons of Christmas houses. It's one of my favorite, favorite hard goods to sell, actually. I right, just threw a little bit of packing paper in there. You don't really need too much because it's a pair of shoes. Uh, yeah. If you know, if you ever bought shoes from Nike, they just like throw them into a box. They don't really care. All right, this is going through the eBay authentication process, which means I ship them via FedEx and I get a free label from eBay. So eBay is going to give me a free label right now, FedEx label. We got to drop these off at a Walgreens later today. And then FedEx picks them up and takes them off. Easy peasy. So there we go. As long as the box is under 30 pounds and is within 20 by 20 by 20, it ships. Uh, where do you find the Christmas house and never seen them at thrift stores? So if you want to know where I picked them up, you actually got to go on my Instagram page. You got to scroll all the way down. I filled up an entire U-Haul full of Christmas house. I bought out a collection. 
Um, I did that like two years ago. I made all my money back. I've probably at this point made about 25 to 30 grand on that deal. And I still have like 10 grand worth of Christmas houses to sell. They just slowly sell now. They used to sell a lot better two years ago and they kind of started falling off a little bit. Um, I'm sure eventually they'll, they're they going to pick right back up again. But last year I had a hard time selling them, but I've already made all my money back from that deal. So every time I sell one, it's just extra money. How many items do you have listed on average right now? I have almost 2000 items listed. I have 1970. It's like 1970 something, I think. They mention you on their podcast. Yeah, Orlando always mentions me. Orlando has a crush on me. You guys can let him know I said that. He does have a crush on me. <clears throat> One day I'll be on their podcast. You guys should tell him, hey, you guys should have K-Way on your podcast. That would make my life. I would love to be on Pure Awesome Podcast as a, uh, as a uh, guest. They used to do a lot of interviews back in the day. They don't do that much anymore. But, I mean, if you guys haggle them enough and you say, hey, K-Way wants to be on your, on your, on your podcast, I would love to. Um, but they've been on my live a few times. Orlando's come on my live a few times. Um, how much was the collection? Sounds like it was an investment. Yeah, I paid $6,000 for the uh, collection. I made all my money back within a month and a half after I listed it. Some of the houses I was listing in that collection, one of them was a um, Department 56 house. It was, like a, it was like a Halloween Christmas house, kind of. It was like a mix. I forget the name of it. Nightmare Sold. Before Christmas. It was a Nightmare Before no. Christmas. It was something like that. It was some kind of like a clown house or something like that. Sold for 550 bucks within like a day after I listed it. Um, that's also listed on my Instagram page. If you go scroll down, you'll see that um, uh, posting. That's not haggling. That's pestering. Yeah. Does he have YouTube? Your, Pure Hustle Podcast? Yes, they are on YouTube. You just type in Pure Hustle Podcast. They put all their podcasts on YouTube. Awesome people. I love Pure Hustle. They're, they're just, they're just awesome, awesome dudes. And they're the same way. They give away a lot of their information for free. They don't have like a course or anything like that. They do have a group. They have a Discord group. But you can pay if you want to. If you don't want to, you get all the information for free anyway. So it's Pure Hustle Podcast about reselling. That's all they're about is about reselling. Um, Orlando used to do Amazon. Now he does um, uh, primarily eBay. He does a little bit of Amazon. And Mike is like um, the newer of the two of the resellers out of both of the guys. Um, but Mike knows his stuff about like uh, video games and stuff like that. Can you grab the, um, oh, never mind, it's over here. Yeah. All right, next I'm going to have to grab some buble wrap. Throw this down on the table. Maybe slide some stuff over. All right, so this sold on Poshmark for 40 bucks. And yes, I know, I just said that a Christmas house sold on Poshmark. It did. Sold for 40 bucks. I paid $15 for this. Um, so after fee, shipping, cost of goods, what would that be? Um, do, 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 um, I made $17, right? Yeah, $17 profit on this sale. So Christmas houses can sell on Poshmark. If you didn't know. If you didn't know, now you know. They actually sell very, very, very well. I just burped all in your face. Sorry, TikTok and, and YouTube. All right, so we're just going to bubble wrap this up. We don't need too much bubble wrap because the item is already secured in the box. It already has its padding and everything. It's original padding. Um, so I'm just going to bubble wrap the box a little bit, and then we'll package it up. And it should be good to go. Appreciate you guys hanging out. If you're not following already, hit the follow button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already on YouTube. If you're watching on TikTok, you can rewatch this live at any time. It will be posted to my YouTube feed. I'm gonna I move these lives from Facebook to uh, YouTube for that reason. I think it'll, it'll perform better on YouTube anyway. So if you guys are interested, hit that subscribe button. We're gonna be doing these morning packing lives every morning, but Sunday morning. And maybe not on uh, red, white, and blue days if I can't get around to it. All right. That one is bubble wrapped up. What program is that you use? Cross list. Um, I use list perfectly. I have a link in my bio. If you use code KWAY shop, you get 30% off your first month. 65 here in Virginia right now. 76 this afternoon. Yeah, it's probably 80 outside. It's hot outside. Wifey went for a run this morning. I didn't go for a run because I'm lazy. She said it was hot. It was hot. All right, so we're just going to take a uh, priority mailbox. You can use any priority mailbox when you ship on the uh, Poshmark. Appreciate the uh, nachos, Chris. So there we go. We have a little bit of void space around the outside, so I'm just going to throw a little bit of packing paper around the outsides, and this one should be good to be shipped. I actually got to buy some more. I think we're out after this roll, so I'm going to buy some more of this today. I have a tax question. Chris takes all your tax questions. So if you have any tax questions, hit him up. What's up, Nicole? Cole Kobe's in the, in the chat. 
Nicole, Kayla's gonna be live here soon. Go make sure, I don't know if you're, is she following you? I think she was in your chat the other day. She's gonna be live here in a little bit. Nebraska is negative two, holy cow. Yeah, you can keep all that. Watch it from Snowbank. Fun fact, I have never seen snow in my entire life. Chris at peak, he's up here. He'll take all your tax questions. I don't like taking tax, I'm just messing with you. I don't like taking tax questions because I'm not a tax professional. If you have a really easy tax question, I can try to help you. But remember, I'm not a tax professional. This is not tax advice. Um, talk to a tax professional if you have any of those. Tennessee is 62. Oh, I wanna go back to Tennessee. Mm -hmm. Tennessee is so nice, such a nice place. All right, so that one is packed up. I went ahead and put everything in there. Give it a little shake test. Nothing's moving around, so we're good to go. And then you take and you seal it up. This is under five pounds. So on Poshmark, it ships for that Poshmark rate. Um, Poshmark rates did go up for buyers, so just keep that in mind. I think they're paying like 20 something cents more or something like that per um, shipment. So just keep that in mind. Um, people might start lowering their offers just because they think they're losing out um, on that little bit of a discount. But trust me, you're still getting a great discount when you purchase on Poshmark because an item like this would probably on eBay, where's this going? It's going to California. So an item like this would probably cost this buyer around $15 shipping and they bought it on Poshmark. So it only cost them under $8 to ship it. So either way, they're still getting a great deal on an item like this. And that's all she wrote. What time is it? It's almost 11. It's 1140. I got to hurry up. If you guys have any last minute questions, drop them down in the chat. If not, you can feel free to ask them in my wife's chat. She's going to be uh, live here in a minute. She's going to go over all of her finds from yesterday. I can't answer all questions. That's why I'm in the background. If they have any questions, I think I'm throw them away. She needs hard questions, she said. She said, give her all the oh, hard questions. Me. Every hard question you have, go ask her. If you have any tax questions, she's the one you need to ask oh, about tax Lord. questions. No, no time uh, Do you wash thrift store um, shirts? Sometimes they smell like cologne. I don't. I don't normally pick up like super smelly shirts. Very, very rarely do I. Um, but I only wash items if they have stains or bad smells. That's it. Normally I don't. So normally I don't. <clears throat> my first year, I haven't sold a ton. Um, do I give the tax people all my inventory? Um, or just what sold. So you can talk to your tax professional. They're going to tell you to do it two ways. They're either going to tell you to do your taxes based off the items you have sold or do your taxes based off of all the items you have bought and then do your tax um, deduction off that. So talk to your tax professional. They'll be able to help you. There's two ways to do those taxes. Um, I do it the way where I just calculate how much I spent on inventory for that year and that's what I use. I don't do each individual sale and deduct each item um, it is the best, that's the best way to do it, but I started doing it the other way when I first started. So I think it's every five years you can change. Again, I'm not a tax professional. I think it's every five years you can change to the other way, but you can only do that once every five years. Um, I believe again, I'm not a tax professional. That's what I've heard. Um, but I'll talk to my tax advisor. They'll be able to help me out with that. Eventually I'm probably going to switch to that way. Cause it's a lot easier to track taxes that way. Um, especially if you've already bought your inventory, you actually save money on taxes. If you do switch it every now and then. Um, and you're legally allowed to do that, but yeah, talk to your tax advisor. Um, I don't answer tax advisor, but here's, yeah, that's why I hate doing it because it's so hard. It's so hard <clears throat> to change, uh, to change, uh, cost good methods. Talk to your tax advisor. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to answer any more questions about that. <laughs> there's a, there's a way you can do it, but, uh, you got to talk to your tax person and they can help you out. I'm not a tax professional. So I'm just a dumb guy that sells you shirts online. That's it. That's what I do. If you guys have any last minute questions, drop in the chat. Remember, follow my wife, Kay the Book Nerd. She is going to be live here in just a minute. She is going to go over all her women's finds from yesterday. What's your favorite tax accounting method? You mean like, how do I keep up with my taxes? Jason Hayes Spreadsheet. I have a link tree link in my bio. If you use code THANKSWAYNE10, you get 10% off. I'm sick of tracking um, it per item. Yeah, it, uh, it, it's rough, but you got to do it. It's part, part, of, part of the job. <laughs> No, you're good, Steph. You're good. You're good. All right, I'm going to go ahead and hop off. Like I said, Wifey's going to be live here in just a moment. I appreciate you guys hanging out. If you missed any part of this over on TikTok, feel free to go over to YouTube and you can rewatch this entire live over on YouTube. If you have any questions during the live, if you're rewatching, you have a question, you can drop a comment and I will answer your comment. I will answer you back. I get all the notifications and all that good stuff. So head over to my wife's live right now. I'm going to go ahead and head off. 
Peace out and y'all have a great day. And I'll see you tonight at 9.30 over on TikTok. I will be live. Appreciate the rose. Peace out.